Guys, welcome back to Stone Block 3. To begin with, Happy New Year. I hope you had a good time with your family, guys. If not with your family, with your friends, if not with anybody, I hope you are feeling great and ready for the new year. Back to the episode, guys. In this episode, we are making singularities. In particular, we are making eight singularities that I believe are mid-level. Maybe some of them are more difficult for somebody, but for me, they seemed very easy. In this episode, we are making the nitro, the balloon, the pig iron, the emerald cluster, the wall, the add-on, the uraninite and the train track singularity. So let's get to it guys. But before we start with the singularities let's make the red matter tools and red matter armor upgraded to gem armor which i believe is the best armor in this pack so we made all the black matter tools which we upgraded to red matter and then we combined them into the red morning star and into the red qatar we tested the red morning star the right click guys it took off a big area but it mostly did me harm because i was accidentally right clicking with it during this episode and <laughs> i was just destroying everything then we made uh, the red matter armor which we upgraded gem armor which is basically the best armor in the game we went to the mother to test the red qatar it was okay then it was time to make the wall machine or the wall uh, I don't know, just walls. You need four field projectors to create a field in which you place one iron block, a redstone and drop a pearl and you get 16 walls. Now you can use these walls to build compacting machines. And this is what I did. We built the biggest one. All you need to do is build a cube which is empty, but in the middle it has some kind of block. The biggest one needs a netherite block. I was confused because as always it was not displaying any graphics, but we made it. Now you place it and use a personal shrinking device to get inside and to go outside as well. Now I'm going to speed this up, but basically I build another wall machine inside the compacting machine. Um, the design is not the best and not the quickest. It took me ages to get to 2k wall singularity, but it was my design and I was happy about it. All right guys, I love this. I love the compact machines. I am a bit of a noob in them, as you already noticed, but it's working now. <laughs> and I can show you what I made, guys. This is absolutely amazing. So we're automating the, the wall singularity. And basically, what I've done is I put a block placer, which places an iron block. I've got a deployer placing redstone. I've got a dropper dropping ender pearl, and this is making the walls. And I also have a redstone circuit that basically provides an infinite pulse of redstone. Maybe you guys know something better than that, but that's what I thought of. It, it, isn't, it isn't looking very pretty, but it works. And the item collector, of course, collects the walls. Now, I'm not sure if I need to somehow load. Right, guys, I don't understand. It's not working like... like it's not loading inside and i'm not sure what's the problem all right guys so i think we just need to open our map go here to claim champ claim it and i'm not sure about the force load. should make it work yeah guys it's working next one is emerald clusters girl next one is emerald class and i haven't found a creative way to do it most likely you've seen other people do the same so basically you use a builder with a silk touch clearing quarry and an emerald cluster filter. Then you just build columns with emerald, what do you call them? The budding emerald together with pedestals and watches of flowing time. And you just set the builder to repeat the action. That's it basically. 
very easy to make but nothing special all right guys so yeah i also automated the nitro crystal singularity um i'm not sure if you can <laughs> make something less complicated but what i did is i put a compressed refined emc link providing blaze mesh never star and, blo and a block of redstone connected to an emi controller and then the emi controller is connected to some crafting process crafting storage and crafting uh, co-processing units and also connected to this emi pattern provider with pattern for block of blazing crystal and a pattern for nitro crystal i've got five energizing orbs connected to it one two three four five each one has an in emi import bus also connected to it for the items to go back into the system and then i have an export bus connected to the neutronium compressor requesting nitro crystal and a crafting card which basically sends crafting signal to the emi system now it's going okay i'm not sure if i can um, like the crafting process it requests this, requests process then it takes a break etc etc anyways then i also automated the train track singular quite easy to automate here is stone slab going into two deployers deploying stone uh, iron nuggets and the mechanical press that's it basically and i mean to speed it up you can set up a few of those i'm not going to do that yet this must be the slowest I also automated the Urana. Uh, you know which one I mean, right? <laughs> I, can nev I will never be able to. Uraninani. Uranini. Same way as the Nitro one. But I've created three of those with uh, four energizing rods and four energizing orbs. Each one with process pattern. If it works. we need an export bus that it's crafting Oish. all right that's gonna be a fast one next one next one is big iron ingot singularity i've set up a huge foundry for the blood and basically i provided the foundry with some zombie heads which are emcable And then we needed the blood to go into casting basins to make blood blocks. The blood blocks go into a crafter and make coagulated blood. Then I emc some iron and some clay which go into an induction smelter. And these three together combine into pig iron ingots. All right, guys, now we have the big iron ingot singularity. I upgraded the farm with the uh, watches of flowing time, and I also placed three induction smelters. All right, guys, the uranine singularity is done. On the next one, nice. Okay, the wall one is very slow. This is going okay, nitro one. So the train one is okay, it's going okay but slow as well. This one, the pig iron is going fantastic. Alright guys, next one, which I think is quite easy, this one. Add-on processing tire 2. And I think I'm gonna do this one in a compacting machine once again. So the end result will come from dissolution chambers. All right, guys, we got the three dissolution chambers. Now, we need redstone dust, diamond gear, glass, craft fermentation. And you just put them in the dissolution chamber and lock the in. All right, guys. So behind the dissolution chambers, we're going to set up a refined EMC link, compressed refined EMC but i think the previous level is also enough we just need five items and the crafter which is going to make 
glass uh, panes and basically this thing provides glass to the crafter and everything else to the dissolution chamber now the last thing we need is latex for this we set up a column of factory block placers and provided them with acacia the best wood for latex and then just placed fluid extractors all around the acacia logs and of course fluid pipes to pump out the latex into our dissolution chambers all right guys this one is done as well it's going okay it's going okay so as explained the solution chambers make the addons the crafter makes the glass panels this one provides everything else to the solution chambers to the log placers and then the these things the liquid extractors produce the latex and yeah guys that's it all right guys pig iron ingot is done very nice let's place it on the wall of fame <laughs> right guys for the next one we'll need the harvest goddess ban this accelerates the crops growth and as you can see i've started a little setup here for treated planks going into a crafter crafting pitted wood slabs we got about 12k ready this is a coke oven making coke and creosite oil from block of coals super enhanced by the watches and i've just got the oil pumping in from the coke oven into seared casting basins and then i have planks and blocks of coal planks pumping into the seared casting basins coals pumping into the coke oven and then the result the treated planks treated wood planks go in a chest then they go in a crafter now <laughs> we can skip the chest actually i'm not sure why. let's actually do that okay it's working it needs power now for these we're doing the balloon singularity so we got the treated wood slabs torch is emcable tough ta fabric the stick and industrial hemp and this is what we're gonna automate next now let's see guys i believe if we just place this here and activate it oh my god it's okay it's not uh, that fast maybe we should place more might place more here hold on that name see it again amazing get a few cheat our way like cheating right wait what ah so you need to replant them i guess this will work let's see can we build it Oh, flower pot, nice, nice. It right here. And how does this? Work? Oh my God! Oh, and. Oh my god, what am I doing? I need seeds. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. I see. We need a range upgrade. Do we have any left? I don't... I guess this should do good job oh my god definitely yes all right so aha uh -huh. okay place the plant sower here and then let's provide it with power let's dive we 
What is this? Is it is it planting something? Anyway. Let's do that. I don't want anything here yet. And this fight him with initial M seeds and an upgrade. Do you have any other add-ons? We do speed, processing, and efficiency. Wish that will assist with the job. How is it planting? Okay. Okay. Nice. With Oh, that's this thing. Right. All right. How about I pick it up from there? Place it here. All right. And then what if I set up an item collector? An advanced item collector, not here. Let's do chest. Let's do a chest, like a stove. Mm. If the advanced item goes here, and we need the seeds, perfect. Can I place it on the actual thing without the chest? Like this. Hold on. Hold on. Um, like a soul. Let's see. Wait, please. And then I want and shown. Perfect. I think I don't even need that. I use another one. Let's see, it's here. Perfection. Noise. Why is this not collecting? How do I make it so that the overflow? Noise. I mean, uh, you can make it, uh, like, you know, less complicated than I do, but I like it like Crafter, Fire Free, let's actually EMC that boy, be getting almost everything, but I think we have everything we need. Now I want to pump it into Ender Chest. Hello? Why is this not working? Are there no ba balloon singularities? Balloon singularity? That's that takes a while. It's cheesy to the max, guys. Cheesy to the max. Alright. Those Bim ba boom. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's so funny, guys. This absolute madness. Madness. All right, guys. So I. AFK for 48 hours and our train track, our wall singularity, which one, which else, and the balloon singularity. All of them are ready, 2k. All right, guys. So basically, this is it for this episode. We've done eight singularities. We've done the balloon one, the nitro one. The train track, 
the pig iron, the add-on, the uranium and any new unit, the this is not the one, the wall one. Did I miss one? I don't remember, guys. It's been so long for me. I hopefully the episode was enjoyable for you guys. I might have sounded tired and I'm sorry about that. I hope to make up in the next episode. Uh, as you can see, I'm holding a dagger, a sacrifice dagger, because I want to stop myself with all this progress. The pack at this point is very grindy and it's not very enjoyable, to be honest. Anyways, guys, I really hope you enjoyed the episode and I really hope to see you back and see you in the next one. Bye.